Hi folks, Kristen Larson here with The Canning Garden. Today, I wanna to make popovers. What are popovers? Well, I can tell you what they're not. They're not a roll, they're not a cupcake, they're not a muffin, they're a popover. Let me show you how I make them. They are so delicious. To make successful popovers, I have found that having a popover pan is critical. This is a popover pan. It kind of looks like a deep muffin dish or deep cupcake dish, but it's actually just meant for popovers. Begin by greasing the popover cups. Just a little bit of spray oil is all that's needed. The ingredients are really basic. Cup of flour, cup of milk, half a teaspoon of salt, and two eggs. I've got my milk, my salt, And two eggs. I take a fork and just mix the dry ingredients and I don't want to over stir this. As you can see the batter is still a little lumpy. That's okay. Just for good measure I take a spatula and just go all the way around. Make sure I really have the bottom parts mixed in there and that's good. Now I'm going to put it in the popover pan. Fill the cups about half full. The batter is evenly distributed in the popover cups. Now this is my secret that I learned uh, that I've used from a cookbook is to put the popover mixture in a cold oven and then turn the heat up. A Little bit different, but trust me, it works. Popovers are going in the oven, cold oven, Set the temperature for 435 and the timer for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, these are my popovers. And this is how you eat them. Break them open. Oh, they're nice and hot here. They're hollow on the center and put your butter in there. So delicious. Enjoy.